This is Twit. Badge, it is like the status symbol of all status symbols at DEF CON. You have an so Uber badge cool. and people will just look at you and go, They're like, oh, oh. That guy oh, did some oh. hacking to get that. Exactly. Oh, that's so cool. But it's not just hacking the device. The crypto challenge literally is all over the show floor. And go, go to those photos. So for DEF CON 22, uh, Alex, if you could run those, this was one of the, uh, the graphics that you see in the main hall. And it just looks like a bunch of zeros and ones. You see the, the symbol for DEF CON, but then advance to the next picture and you start seeing Numbers? Like, like numbers. And if, if you didn't know there was a crypto challenge going on, just go, uh, go ahead and forward to the next one. You, you wouldn't understand what they are. But Yeah, you just say, oh, this is a cool design. A cool design with a yeah. couple of numbers. But no, that's not how it works on DEF CON. At DEF CON, <laughs> everything has some sort of meaning. Now, uh, I I'm not going to guide you through the entire crypto challenge because that would probably take an entire episode wow. in and of itself. <laughs> uh, but regardless to say, uh, needless to say, it, it was, it's fun. Yeah, it's re it's like a it's, it's it's like an Easter egg hunt or a, a scavenger thing, but like on another high tech mystery scale. Yeah. There are people who come to DEF CON and this is all they do. They don't go to any of the talks. <laughs> I could see that. They don't go to any of the workshops. Yeah. They they sit there with their team and they just hack away. Now watch this. Actually, here, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and touch these pads. Go ahead and go back, which look just like decoration. But go ahead and back go back to my computer, and if I start touching these pads. What? It stops, and now it's giving me other messages. What? This is all built into the badge for DEF CON. Albert might be on the phone with Harold, so if right. it's busy, try back. Where okay. to the And see, now the these, these are clues for the crypto challenge. And what we figured out was there was, if you did a Google search for Harold and Albert, you came out with, uh, it was a person who actually did some work in, crypto in cryptography, and there was a phone number that was listed. And if you called that phone number, you would get a message that you would then include in the snippet of code, that a snippet of text that's included here as a URL, which would get you to a website that would give you the next clue that would let you move on in the crypto challenge. <laughs> <laughs>